Hey guys, I'm Matt Mandan here. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make QuickTime better if you guys like to use QuickTime as an overall video player. Um, there are other video players like F uh, VLC, um, etc, etc. Um, and I'm going to be showing you guys how to add a lot of the main codecs to QuickTime that QuickTime lacks. Um, if any of you guys try to play ABI or FLB videos, usually you guys will get an error and it says visit this, the Apple website to get the code for it. Yeah, you usually get that error and it's really annoying. Well, I'm going to be showing you an application called Perian, which allows you to add all those codecs into QuickTime to allow you to play ABI files like this one right here. Um, before I play the video and show you guys the demo, I'm going to show you guys how to get. So you guys going to open up your web browser and go to perian.org. And you guys will be brought to the download page on the home page. That will be the uh, drop page. And you guys can just download it. Um, if you guys want to see what the actual codecs it supports, you guys can go to the detail tab and read all about it here. Like a, one of the main ones is everyone wants to have this ABI because that is usually the default um, Windows or main Windows video output. So I'm going to close that. And once you guys have it downloaded, it will probably be a system preference file, uh, system props. And you guys will just double click it and it will open up in system preferences like this just like this and you guys will get this down here and you guys can do all the configuration files uh, you can change all the settings in here you can remove it um, see I have the current version 1.1 2.1 you can check for updates when it's clicking and obviously there are no updates um, the audio settings and then uh, the subtitles uh, and this is just an about page you can go to their website or form or you can donate to them I recommend it because it's an awesome awesome uh, tweak or codec for a good time um, so I'm going to close this, and I'm going to show you guys how it actually works. So as you mostly know, um, ABI files do not work on um, Mac unless if you have Perry installed. I will have this file uh, down link in the description if you guys want to download it and test it out. So I'm going to open it up. Oh, and it loads. See, pretty bad quality video, but as you can see, it actually loads. But you guys will probably have better quality. The quality on uh, the codec is amazing and it's perfect. So guys, that was your Mac Man Dan tutorial. Make sure to check out your MacmanDan.tk, which is currently in this construction, so uh, please bear with it. And uh, guys, I'm sorry for the lack of videos lately. I've been extremely busy and I hope to get back onto it. Um, I'll probably have some iPhone and iPod Touch tutorials and jailbreaking since the new uh, firmware and stuff has come out. And I'll uh, catch you guys in the next video. Peace.